I found the best three jump shots on the game. So for this first jump shot, you will not rip. Oh my God, what you jumping at? I'm telling you this right now, this jump shot is going to change your entire 2K experience. So we're going to want to go Steph Curry base, Oscar Robinson release one, Colin Sexton release two, release speed four out of four, 86% Oscar Robinson, 14% Colin Sexton. Look at the grades, y'all. A release height, which means that you can little face people, aka shoot over people because the A release height, and it is a high grade. Release speed A+, plus, which means that the shot is going to be as quick as it can be when it comes to the release speeds. Defensive immunity A-, minus, which means that this jump shot is immune to the defense and you will not be getting contested as much as if let's say the defensive media was a b plus this is the very first jump shot right here this is an old reliable but i would advise you guys to stay in tune because i got some shooting tips and i'm gonna teach y'all how to use these and i'm gonna teach y'all when to release these jump shots as well now before we even get into the next two jump shots that have even bigger green windows then the last jump shot that i gave y'all which was the curry base the stephen curry base Keep in mind that you must, you must have the correct shot timing visual cue that I have on. If you do not put on the same shot timing visual cue that I have on as of right now, you will not be grinning like this when it comes to putting on these jump shots. As far as this next jump shot that I'm about to give y'all, this is possibly the fastest jump shot in the game. Yo, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. This jump shot is faster than the the squirrel running away from you when you're trying to chase it bro like on some real stuff yeah like you ever been outside trying to chase a squirrel whatever the case may be and then the squirrel just runs like fast as hell that's how fast this jump shot is this jump shot is fast as hell though y'all just peep how fast the jump shot gets off look at that like look how fast it, like he couldn't even get to me bro he couldn't get to me like it's so fast that when i shot the ball and it was green it literally didn't go all net like i know how like every time you green a shot it goes all net bro this is how fast the jump shot is that it's so fast it hit the rim so goddamn fast that it hit the rim so fast that once it hit the rim it didn't even go all net because that's how fast it was what <laughs> so here goes the second jump shot right here steph curry base kendrick nunn upper release one upper release two darius garland i went three out of four speed and i've been using three out of four speed with this particular jump shot right here this jump shot is extremely 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 fast as y'all can see by the release speed it's maxed out to a fully a plus it's like no type of space this jump shot is the fastest that it can get not gonna lie to y'all the animation blending is 55 percent kendrick nunn 45 percent demi lillard if you want to mess with the blendings of the shot you can do that but i'm not gonna lie i think i'm gonna just leave it at this for the shot time and visual cue you do want to use release shot time visual cue in this game as i believe and i think in my opinion that release is the best shot time visual cue in the game as far as time of your shot when it comes to speed ups slow downs whatever the case may be for this next jump shot this is probably my favorite jump shot as of right now in nba 2k24 this jump shot is just goddamn green bean chicken bean y'all boys should already know that i have the best jump shots in the game in nba 224 and it's been like this since last year y'all if y'all missed out on me last year man 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 i could have put y'all onto some sauce but if you're here right now and you're still watching this video and you have not skipped which most of the people are probably gonna skip this part of the video listen i appreciate you make sure you hit that like button hit the subscribe button and more importantly turn on notifications you will not miss another video like one of these listen though y'all i'm not a jump shot plug but i'm here for it all i'm here for the best entertaining content most informing vids on youtube and y'all can quote me on that before we get into the last and final jump shot as y'all can see green bean chicken bean i always show y'all my jump shots before i give it to y'all no matter what y'all i don't just give jump shots with no type of evidence that these are the best jump shots in the game when i say they're the best jump shots in the game i'm telling y'all y'all gotta take my word for it these are literally the best jump shots in the entire game uh-huh cookies thank you we'll take it hold on you know what this is that's green bean chicken meat come on now we in there we are in there y'all one more shot look at this dude <laughs> oh my god where you going boy green bean oh yeah oh yeah y'all ready y'all ready for this one so here it is the last and final jump shot jalen brunson base damian lillard release one tyrese maxi release two very quick release speed as y'all can see this jump shot is fast this is a bonus jump shot right here i wasn't supposed to give y'all this jump shot this early 
But y'all boys know that I never gatekeep anything. Anything that I find, I will always put y'all onto the sauce. But I'm trying to say this is my favorite jump shot in the game as of right now. Season 2. You want to make sure that you have released shot time and visual cue, y'all. Release shot time and visual cue will change your entire 2K shooting experience. So as far as mastering the shooting, this is how I practice my shooting every single time I get on the game. I go to play now. I come over here to blacktop. Once I come over to blacktop, I do 2v2 or you can do 3v3 right pick the team which is ringers or ballers it doesn't matter you want to make sure that the core size is full course so that you can have full capabilities when you're shooting the ball and stuff like that so it won't be a half court set then you want to make sure that the game conditions are set to 50. after you do that and click advance it will bring to the players you got to keep clicking triangle until you find your my player in the case of my player being talent period boom click on this click triangle again click joel and b i'm just this is just the fast way to do it click triangle again i pick bill russell to be on my team click triangle again and then you probably Probably pick like Allen Iverson or like something like that right then you advance so I was gonna push you into the game as in blacktop and this is how you practice your shooting right here yo this is how you get the shooting mechanics down this is how you get used to the timing of release timing because there is no latency in the game y'all so it might be a little less latency in here but I promise y'all it's not a crazy crazy latency from here to the park or whatever game mode you play as you can see i'm greening that right there no speed ups no slowdowns. just get used to the shooting in here shoot as many shots as you can get used to release shot timing visual cue because that is what i use and that is what i recommend every single one of you guys should use in this game because it's just the best one in the game hands down i do not think that i could ever use push set point or or even jump i might use it for a different type of video but yeah though y'all this is literally how you just get used to the shooting every single time literally put it on hall of fame come in here put it on 50 points and just try to shoot as many shots as you can and try to green as many shots as you can and if you guys are wondering why i'm not in the gator facility or trying to shoot in a gator facility whatever the case may be is because it is way too damn delayed and there is no space so this is the best way to practice your jump shots especially on an ai especially when you are trying to perfect your craft and perfect your shooting if y'all want a tutorial on how to get into the my league and my nba that will probably have to be a whole separate video because it's way too much to explain yeah though y'all you just want to sit here and shoot as many shots as you possibly can like until you get tired y'all that's the probably the best way i can explain it shoot as many shots over the ai even after you finish getting to 50 points which is the game conditions that i told you to set it to if you don't feel comfortable and you don't feel like you're ready to go to the park or anything yet guess what start up another game try to get to 50 points again but that's probably really all i can say and have hotspots so you have to have hotspots in this game you guys have to have lethal hot zones in this game as well without those things you will not be able to shoot good in this game whatsoever what the hell did i just hit a white every single jump shot through the first one through the third one make sure you use release shot timing visual cue as you can see right here i am using release shot time and visual cue you do not want to use anything else when it comes to these jump shots that i gave y'all today but that's all i have for you guys i hope y'all enjoyed the video i hope i can help make sure you hit the subscribe button hit that like button and more importantly turn on post notifications so you will not miss another video like one of these i love y'all boys so 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 much i see y'all in the next one Woo! i will be back tomorrow i will be back tomorrow